Hey, Microwave Bulls, welcome back to LEGO DC Super Villains Customs. Now, today we're going to be doing a little bit of an obscure character, and that is Lionel from uh, Dead Alive. I recently watched this movie for the first time, and I really liked it. I thought it was hilarious, like laugh out loud hilarious. Um, but technically, it's, it's a horror comedy, but that's still horror. Uh, so yeah. Uh, it's done by P the film, it, which is, this is a crazy thing. It was directed by Peter Jackson, the same guy who did uh, Lord of the Rings and King Kong 2005. Oh, we're on this side now. All right, that means we're getting rid of Seven Granddad. Another obscure character, very obscure. Um, all right, so. Lionel, he's got a pretty normal face, but I'd say we go with the um, this face. Um, yeah, maybe we can get a, some blood on his face or something like that. All right, so we got that face. Uh, wait, we gotta change the skin color, right? There we go, and then wrinkle detail. Color do we? Yeah, we usually use that color. And then he's got brown eyebrows. Uh, let's check accessories to see if we can. <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, try and recreate the blood on his face from the finale. Um. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. That kind of sucks. But you know, it is what it is. Uh, neck. I don't think we need anything. Back into match attachments. Nope. All right. So he's he's got some pretty simple hair, and I think. Ooh, what does this one look like? Uh. Uh. Let's go with this one. Make it. Is there a darker brown? No. Okay. It wait. Is there? No, that's not dark brown. Yeah, it's probably about there. All right. Uh, all right. He's got white arms. Since he's wearing a white button-up shirt. You know what? Let's add a little bit of detail. Even though it's a button up, it's yeah, it still works. There we go. All right, uh, hands. Same as his face. A uh, body, a uh, preset body. He's wearing a a vest with a button up shirt underneath. So we'll see how this goes. Oh. Even though he's not wearing a bow tie in the movie, this works really well. I, uh, let's go with this one. All right, hips. Uh, he's, he's got he's got a belt on, so let's get that belt in there. Uh, I'd say this one. Actually, use Constantine and then, oh wait, we can't. All right, so I guess this one, after all. Uh, legs. Uh, we can just do boots. What color is that? There we go, got it. All right. Um, no capes, effects, uh, hit impact, uh, start one, and then we'll make it red for blood. I know, we've done that for the past few characters, but it's all horror, so it works. Alright, cool, cool. Personality, health, health icon, uh, I'd say red. And then health type, standard, he's just a guy. Uh, let's go with voice. Mm. 
Voice 2, I guess. Uh, speed, normal, target. Um. Mm. <clears throat> well, let's go with uh, the Joker. This so will match his vest. Um, animation. Let's. I'm gonna go with Trickster because there's so many cool like uh, zombie kills in the movie. So yeah, including the lawnmower, which we won't be able to recreate for obvious reasons. Uh, but yeah, let's get rid of this weapon. But yeah, there's a lot. This movie's very creative. So, and this uh, move set here with the crazy, the trickster uh, animation gives them all sorts of things. Uh, no grow. He doesn't grow. Um, double jump. Uh, no hyper jump. Square. We'll just do normal attack. Hold. We'll do... Um... Destroy mode to sort of reference the lawnmower in some sort of way because yeah probably that because it's like pressing forwards you know if you've seen the movie you know what I talk about with the lawnmower scene um um we'll do this one and then we'll make it yellow to reference the custard scene very disgusting but it's still there um and I guess this, uh, to reference, uh, the tr tranquilizer, uh, we'll do, uh, heat beam, and then, sorry if you hear a whining dog, he, he pooped on the floor, so, he gets time out, uh, but I don't know if you can hear him or not, uh, let's make it, like, um, a light brown color I guess and then let's do right hand because why not shake things up a little bit uh, skills technology not set in the 50s I mean they had technology obviously but not like advanced technology like that uh, acrobat yeah because he hangs on I think it's a chandelier or something and he swings back and forth um Let's see. Yeah, I'd say that's about it. But yeah, he definitely goes a little crazy at the end of the movie. After, well, specifically after the lawnmower scene. Uh, no affiliation. And I'd say he's a hero. He kills zombies. Alright. Lionel. There we go. I feel like the, uh, the... What type of animation is this? Uh, Trickster. The Trickster animation walks slower than the other customs. I might be wrong about that though. All right, attack, attack. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about about creativity and stuff like that. All right, let's do. Let's attack Leatherface over here to get that blood. Then we got our destroy mode, and then we got. Uh, then we got the custard in that custard scene. So we got our uh, uh, tranquilizer, animal tranquilizer. Keep on slurring my words. Jump, double jump, jump, slam, dodge, and dodge. Uh, but yeah, I think that is it. So yeah, guys, this has been another episode of LEGO DC Super Villains Customs. Today we have made Lionel from Dead Alive, also known as Brain Dead. I forgot to mention that. In, in America, it's known as Dead Alive, but everywhere else, it's known as Brain Dead. 
just to put that out there. Alright. But yeah, that's all for today's episode. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!